Inspector Castillo has explained why you felt you had to run away. I realize now that the punishment we have imposed was unfair and cruel to you. You have my word that we won't keep you apart again. Come here. How are you feeling? Are you better? Yeah. How about you? I still think we would be better off by ourselves. Then we wouldn't be stuck with a bunch of kids nobody wants and people who don't like them. You know, I can tell that Sister Gabrielle really cares about you. But she's human. I mean, sometimes she gets upset or tired or maybe she just doesn't want to be nice, you know? Just like the way Eden and I are with our kids sometimes. Boy, they must have to be real tough. No, they're, they're lucky. Because they have a mother and father who love them and they have a home of their own. But you see, not all homes are the same. Eden grew up without her mama, and I grew up without my daddy. The important thing is that you both have people here who really love you. It's their job. If this was really a home, they wouldn't call it that. Why don't you go? You've kept your promise. Can we come back and visit you? What for? What for? We like you. I like you. I wish you were my mom. Cut it out, Hallie. She's not your mom. She has kids of her own to take care of. She'll forget about us. Bedtime, Hallie. Okay, I'll see you in the morning. At okay. Bye, Hallie. Mm -hmm. Well, I guess we're going to be uh, pushing off. You take good care of your sister, okay? Okay. We will come back and visit you. That's another promise. <laughs>